Uh, you have both played such excellent villain characters, and I would like to know if there is a secret to being so evil. And can you share it with me? Because I'd like to know. I wear a weasel in my pants. <laughs> it makes me feel evil. I, I didn't think, uh, well, when you play evil, you don't think it's evil. That's true. You, you think, uh, oh, he's got the right idea. Like, like for instance, in uh, It's a Wonderful Life, Mr. Potter, yeah. who tries to buy off uh, George Bailey. Yeah. Well, actually, if you look at modern economics, the way they're going now, uh, Mr. Potter, who's an evil, evil bastard, uh, he had the right idea. So whenever I play a bad guy, I think, no, no, uh, I can embrace that. I don't take it home with me, because, you know, <laughs> scares the cat. <laughs> <laughs> but I think you have to take a mindset that, that, that the guy is correct in his thinking and that he's actually trying to do something good. And that makes it really evil. Because then you can't even get through to the guy, right? Yeah, you're playing Satan, but you've got to make him cuddly. <laughs> it's like, hi, welcome to hell. My name is Satan. Yeah. Um, you can call me Stan if that makes you feel more comfortable. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank and you, a good laugh you. will get you a million miles in Bad Guy Town. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> you finished on time. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. Thank you, guests. Thank you. Thank you very much, folks.